Okay, so if you put 120 minutes here, then this guy, we want this timer um, incrementing to show you where you're at and how far, you, how close you are to 120 minutes, for example. If you put 15 minutes, whatever. Um, this is a data edit. And this right here is a date time property. So kind of show you how I got there. So in order to do the conversions, um, so basically you have to use a time data type for the accumulation timer for the ET. So that's what I'm doing here. Uh, I'm using the time, uh, accumulation timer, I'm using a time, and then I'm basically taking that time, converting it to seconds, and then taking seconds and converting it to date time. And why we need date time is because we're using a date time property right here, as you can see, date time, so that you can use a peer, the format, these options as the format. So it's, this is the important part. This is kind of why I made the video is that it's important to have capital H's for the hours and not lowercase. So it, it, let me go test it for you real quick. So as you can see, um, we have zero, 16 minutes and 11 seconds, zero hours. And that's exactly what it shows up here. 16 minutes, 17 seconds, et cetera. So let, let me show you, I'm gonna show you um, kind of what happens here if we force one hour into there. So let's go do that right now. So I'm just gonna, as you can see here, I'm not gonna explain exactly what I'm doing because it's kind of self-explanatory, but I'm gonna stop this timer and then push one hour, 20 minutes, 54 seconds inside of our HMI accumulation. So as you can see, one hour, 20 minutes and 54 seconds. So this is acting normally. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to change the sealer hours to um, lowercase and kind of show you what issues I ran into. I'm gonna change this to lowercase and I'll show you here in a minute what the result is. Okay, so we actually changed it. Here's the result. We changed it to lowercase h, lowercase hours. Uh, let me go back to it and show you what I did. So it's lowercase, I wrote to the machine, and as you can see here, it all looks great, right? One hour and 20 minutes, but that's because I'm still forcing one hour and 20 minutes into it. So let's go back and put this P off here, uh, remove that force, and then enable the accumulation timer. I'm gonna write that in. And then you'll see what I was referring to. So um, let's push that in there. Okay, so we're back to 16 minutes and 40 seconds. So now let's go back and see what the HMI says. So that's the issue, it shows 12. So it picks a default time of 12, and uh, which is very misleading if you put the hour format in lowercase. So yeah, basically make sure it's in uppercase. I don't know much about the minutes and seconds, if they have to be uppercase or if that even matters. I just left them lowercase and kept the hours to uppercase and that seemed to do what I wanted it to do. So I hope you found this video useful.